Hello gamers, I'm Mortuari and welcome back to a brand new series of Conan Exiles. Yes, a brand new series. And this time, I'm actually on a PvP server, so this is brand new for me. I have been uh, lucky to get invited uh, to a server where a few YouTubers play, a few uh, big names. And yeah, I've uh, been very fortunate to, to join these guys. But yeah, this is a PvP server, so I'm not quite sure how I will handle it. It's also a uh, quietly modded server. So yeah, I will have to discover as we go. But first things first, I think I, it's 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 about time to head to uh, to this area. Oh, you look, you already see some of the mod mods we have. We have a map mod. What does this do? Oh, legends? Really? Oh, oh resources? Oh, nice. Caves temples oh this this is gonna be great actually what's this gps oh longitude and latitude a bit like an arc nice 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 so i think i will be heading uh towards the center of the game uh towards the center of the map actually i already made myself some some clothing learned a few things of course i'm thirsty yeah i will never reach the water in time that's for sure doesn't really matter Meanwhile, I will be getting some XP and yeah, I need to find a spot to build and uh, I have discovered something in single player, well not in single player, on our old server, a little spot where I would like to build and I checked it out in single player again and it looks pretty darn good but I'm hoping I will be able to get there and uh, second thing is I'm hoping it will still be available because the spot is somewhere in the northwestern side of the map. And yeah, I'm gonna head in that direction and see if it's available. Yeah. What? The, oh yeah, true. That thing. That thing. I kind of forgot about it. I gained the level. That's nice. There is a book here. God's curse this sandstorm. We were forced to take refuge before the wind. Learned surrender. Nice. My first emote. There is something in the storm. Yeah, I should probably hurry to the oasis because uh, I'm getting getting pretty thirsty, and I need I definitely need some water. So let me head in that direction, and I'll keep you updated as we go. Okay, I didn't get to the oasis yet, but look what I have found: <sighs> shellback eggs. At least these should supply me with some water and some food for now. Let me check. Ah, oh, yes, yeah, some water. Not really all that much, actually. But it does fill up my food bar, my th uh, thirst and hunger bar, so... Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty happy with that. At least now I can continue and venture forth to the oasis area. Oh, crap. I was just about to say, things have evolved. I got some upgrades, did a few things. Oh, crap. Knocked back on the ship thing. Really, you have to be kidding me. I'm gonna die. You to this crocodile. Phew, that was close. That was very close, actually. So let me get some stuff. Come on, hit it, hit it, hit it. And at least I reached the oasis. So that's good. Should allow me to get some water. Fill my water skin. And drink. Yeah, here we go. I have everything I need. Awesome. So, the plan is now to try and sneak up to the northwest side. I think I'm gonna try to run all the way through this area and head in that direction. And, sh and see if I can find a spot to, to build something there. You have probably seen uh, in my other series that I'm building a big uh, camp up here. And I, I want to go in that same direction, but I don't know if uh, if I will be able to reach it. And uh, what well, the second thing is, the spot I have in mind, I have no idea if it's still available or not. So I will have to check that out and I will keep you guys updated as I head in that direction. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I see something. Whose base is that, actually? Let's have a look. Let's have a quick look. I found the first base. 
First base is by Crowjack. Oh, look. Crowjack is here. Nice. Ah, yeah, Crowjack is uh, one of those YouTubers I have been watching a, a lot lately. Crowjack. Oh, there was Crowjack. There is Krusty, the fabulous Krusty. And there is, of course, John Bain. And apparently, most of them are on the server, so. Even the Roboclop is here. So I bet you, first time I get killed by someone else, uh, you can be sure it will be a Roboclop. Anyway, I'm going to be heading to uh, the place where I'm hoping to be able to build. And I will keep you guys uh, updated along the road. Okay, folks, a little update. I reached the broken bridge and taking a little break to cook some meat. Uh, for, since I'm, I'm kind of out of danger up here. And then I will be trying to move, uh, move onwards, head into the mountains, head through the deserts and see where I can go. There is still a long way to go. Look, I'm here on the map. And I want to go somewhere in this direction. <sighs> this will be some kind of an adventure. And it was really scary to, to run around and uh, have to pay attention to everything. Because, yeah, once you're level 50, you don't really care about your little, little crocodiles and stuff. But, yeah, they seem to be uh, uh, hitting me pretty hard. So I have to pay attention, watch where I'm going. And that's what I will be doing next. I think I will be heading up into the mountains because I'm not quite sure I can head continue that in that direction. I'm pretty sure if I continue in that direction, I will end up in the Thrall uh, village, and I'm not sure I can outrun them. So, yeah, I'll check it out, and I'll keep you guys updated. Okay, I think it's time for another update. Uh, I reached the out outskirts of the un unnamed city, and I'm, I have to admit, I've been pretty scared the whole way already. I got attacked by a scorpion, which almost killed me. So scorpions are very dangerous to me now, especially with the, the crappy armor I have. So I need to really, really, really keep an eye, an eye out for those. If, if that big one gets to me, I'm dead. Dead in a second. So, mm, yeah. I'm gonna have to try and move up bit by bit and be very careful, but I will keep you updated along the road. So guys, it's time for another update. As you can see, I reached the northwestern part of the of the map. I still have some traveling to do in order to reach the spot where I want to build. And I can tell you, this has been the scariest ride of my whole Conan existence. It's really uh, pretty hard to uh, travel up here, being a low level and having no gear. And especially now that I have died a few times, I even lost my water skin. <sighs> yeah. I will try to get to the spot where I want to build, and if I make it, you'll be the first to hear it. Okay, guys. I didn't know I was that close, but this is actually the spot I want to build at. Let's have a look at it in, in all its beauty. Yeah, this is it. And it hasn't been taken yet, so... <sighs> I'm so happy. I'm so, so, so happy. Now, the only thing I need to figure out is... Can I actually build here? Can I actually play some stuff here? Let's see. Uh, what do I have? I have nothing with me actually to build, but I should be able to build at least one foundation. If I can find... Oh, wood. Wood might be an issue, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> let me go gather some materials. Oh, yeah. First of all, let me place uh, my bedroll here. That way. Oh, yeah. The if I place my bedroll, I will know if I can build here. Yes, I can build here. Nice, 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 nice. Up update my spawn point. Yes, I made it. So let me go grab some materials, collect some stuff, and I will be back to you guys with, uh, yeah, with some ideas on what I will be doing here. So um, yeah, let me head out, get myself some wood, and I will be right back. Okay, folks, I think it's time again for a little update. So I have set up base right here. Now, I just placed some uh, some stuff up. Uh, I have my basic crafting setup here. Uh, yeah, tannery, blacksmith, furnace, little box, my bedroll. I did close off, close off this uh, entrance here. I put up some uh, doors and walls. And yeah, that way I can close up this side of the whole thing. Yeah, of course. Then I, you fall down because the doors are to close and out open. Uh, okay, <laughs> let me walk back 
and try to reach the other entrance really quick. It's, yeah, it's just behind the corner, but uh, if those things see me, then I'm dead. Hold on a sec, maybe I should just try to make myself a stair. If I can, oh, I don't have the wood. Then I will have to run past it. I have to. So let's do that really quick. Run past the stupid bug. And head around the corner. Maybe I can find some wood again or some maybe some coal to bring back home actually. Yeah, might be a good idea. Oh, I'm already there. I don't need to do anything. I'm already at my uh, other entrance, although it will probably be tough to get inside here. Yeah, <laughs> I should be placing some uh, some more structures up here too. So the goal is to close this off as well, put up some walls and other things. Maybe I should actually raise uh, this indeed to two foundations high so I can close this off, put up some stairs on one side, stairs on the other side, have a door or a gate maybe. And then I have this area a little bit closed up. So, yeah. I'm not sure yet, yet how I will be building. Since this is PvP, I will have to uh, think about a few things. Like, uh, maybe I should try to build up top of that structure, if possible. And that way, yeah, it will be tougher to, to raid uh, and get access to the to the good stuff. But I will have to check that out if that's at all possible because I have no idea. Of course, I can't get too close to the green. I can get behind this. Oh, yeah, I can. And there is shelter in here. Oh, nice. I didn't know. <gasps> Look, dead people. Huh. No, that's that's teasing. That's really teasing. I have seen a ghost. And normally if you follow the ghosts, you're supposed to get some loot. Uh, but yeah, from the moment I cross this this barrier, I'm dead. So I'm not gonna do it. At least not now. But maybe I can fence this off and actually have a uh, all the big loot in here, the really important loot. Yeah, that's a thing, actually. This might be uh, the area where I put my, my, my boxes up. Hmm, I didn't even know that. It's gonna be that, or I build upwards and close off all this area. Have little uh, stuff up there, but all in all, I think this area is actually pretty safe. It's, uh, yeah, there are no animals or, or creatures spawning in here yet and it's easily defended uh, because it has some natural walls like it there is no way to get in here except if you start building stuff and these things can be broken so I'm, I'm pretty pretty good there I have to close off the two entrances uh, put up some nice defenses up there and then I should be ready and prepared for uh, PvP attacks, possible PvP attacks. Anyway, um, I still have to do some building and some gathering before I can actually uh, close everything up and uh, start building on two, tier 2 stuff because the tier 1 stuff can easily be broken but down just by hitting it with a, a metal, uh, metal uh, weapon. So yeah, I'll, I'll have to fix that. But for the time being, this is gonna be it. Uh, I have my little setup here. And I will have to live with that for now. So I think this is also the perfect opportunity to wrap up today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, feel free to hit the thumbs up button. And, and if you have ideas, suggestions or comments, you can post those in the comment section below the video. Check out the description as well. You'll find links to everyone in there and also links to the uh, social media pages, links to the Patreon uh, page and of course feel free to subscribe to the channel as well. Not only do you help me reach my next subscribe goal but you will also get notified when I post new content to the channel. That being said I'm gonna be wrapping up uh, this episode so until next time have fun and stay safe. Bye!